All right, guys, welcome back to the channel. We are playing up here in Orange County at a place called Monarch Beach. And uh, right now we're, we started on the back nine today. We're on the seventh hole in the back nine, which is actually the 16th hole. But uh, the guys are like three up. And if you guys are new to the channel, hit that subscribe button. We're also doing a giveaway in this video. Uh, the GM here agreed to giving away a foursome out here. So big thanks to them. Make sure you guys check them out and get entered into that giveaway. Links down below. All right, this hole is 366 yards, uh, just a little dog leg to the right. You can see those bunkers out there on the left. Um, pretty wide fairway though, and the wind is coming off the left, so we're gonna just try to hit a good one here and see if we can make another birdie. It's, they've been flowing today. Wow. All right, here's where Coach ended up. He somehow threaded the needle. <laughs> and uh, here's what he's got to work with. A lot of trees, a lot of trees. And then I'll show you guys where the pin is. Right through those trees right there. All right, didn't hit a great drive right there. Pulled it into the palm trees. And uh, I have no shot at the green, so I'm just gonna chip out and uh, make part of the old-fashioned way. Oh, he, hit, he hit a root. <laughs> the guy hit this root right here. Oh my God, the guy hit two trees and it kicks out right short of that bunker up there. <laughs> that is some good clean living, dude. I have 89 to the pin, perfect lie in the bunker, not much of a lip, so no excuse, this should be okay. <laughs> Great shot. Yes! Oh my god, you almost hold it! High five, high five, high five! Yes! All right. All right, push the driver a little bit. I thought the wind was gonna bring it back, but it didn't. Got 120 yards left. I see a ball right next to that flag stick, so that makes my job really simple. I'm just gonna go right at it. We're going for the make. I just pulled it a little bit right of the pin. Got a good bounce, feeding towards the hole. And uh, that was a great golf shot. Ricocheted right off that root, off the tree, <laughs> back into the fairway. Now I'm going to David Thompson. Intentional. Yep. Good clean living. <laughs> oh my gosh. He almost just made it. And that's how you make par <laughs> the old fashioned way. Okay, just a little bit long. Elisa hit a great bunker shot out of there, almost dunked it. You can tell she uh, landed it right next to the hole, spun it back, and then I hit a pretty good 64 degree wedge right below it. to make a little parsky, and then uh, the big cat, he's got about 10 feet coming down the hill. Uh, great bunker shot out of there. And then Isabel is just about 20 feet past the pin on the ridge. <laughs> the hole just got a little smaller. <laughs> wow, they make one birdie and all of a sudden. It'd be a little feisty. Right yeah. <laughs> okay. You guys want to play by prison rules? All right, really pretty hole here. 172 yard par three. Obviously going downhill. Bunch of bunkers pretty much uh, the standard layout out here. Uh, pins in not too tough of a spot, just kind of right center over there. And it looks like you can go a little bit long, maybe even suck it back. The wind is into us, so it should help, uh, help us suck it back off that ridge and see if we can uh, get closer. Started at the flag with the draw. And be pin high, just a little bit left side of the green, maybe 40 footer or so. I started it just right of the pin. It's fading over a little bit, but the wind is holding it. I think he ended up in the bunker on the right. Oh, she hit this one really well. Just left of the pin fading Stay over. 
probably going to be, yeah, middle pin of the high. green. Perfect, pin high. Oh, Isabel hit this really well, but it's uh, just left of the pin. Probably going to be right in the middle of the green. Oh, went a little long. She hit that good. All right, closest one to us is mine. I got a nice little 25 footer, uh, 25 footer down the hill, down the ridge. Uh, to that pin and then Elisa landed it perfect, trickled down. She's probably got about seven, eight feet left. And then Isabel uh, just went a little long. She's in that back rough. Marco is in the bunker again. So see if he can make some magic here. Oh, what a golf shot. Oh, <laughs> A plus effort. He's got about five, six feet left. Oh, that's terrible. Oh, there's no easy money around here. Oh, oh. sniffed it. The girls are making a charge. You're a snow. <laughs> oh my god. All right. Pretty jacked up. Pretty sweet hole right here, 400 yards. Obviously going downhill. A couple bunkers on each side, as you guys can see. And uh, I'm not really sure where the, where the green is on this one. I might be straight ahead. I do see water down there, so I'm guessing that uh, on the pro shot, we're gonna have a little bit of water to contend with. The coach just made that awesome birdie. Girls are tough, they're making birdies, we're making birdies. I think we're two up right now, so we're gonna keep the pressure on them all day and uh, hit another one down the middle here. Driver a little left there, but I got a nice opening here. 115 yards left. Uh, there's some water on this one though. It comes in on the right. I've been missing some shots on the right, so I'm gonna really focus up here and make sure I hit it right at the flag stick and uh, if anything, miss a little left. Oh, I just clipped it to perfection. Wind's got it a little, but okay. Uh, right on the front fringe, good shot. There's Coach's lie. He's over here kind of under this tree and then he's got another tree right in front of him as you guys can see so he's got to either hit one low and just keep it low and commit to that or go up high and make sure he clears that tree but he doesn't have very far to go yeah like marco mentioned i got two choices here i can either just kind of hit a little bump and run four iron right right underneath the tree it's 82 yards or i can take it up and over uh, with my lob wedge so i'm trying to figure it all out he definitely got it over And it's pin high on the right. Isabel hit a perfect layup here, short of this bunker, 125 to the pin. Sounded solid. Got 152 into the wind. I can't see the pin. I think I have a little round bush that is my aim. <laughs> I hope it's right. <laughs> I kind of just rushed up there and looked. I think that was Isabel that hit off that rock right in the front, ricocheted off of it and ended up right there. And then I went a little bit long with that 60 degree. Bounced pretty firm, but I'll take it. And then Elisa, I think hit a really good shot in here. She's probably got about 10, 11 feet. Marco just left his a little bit shy of the green. He's right on the fringe. He's electing to putt it, which is the right play. Okay, she just hit that a little heavy, a little bit short. She's gonna have a downhill putt. Wow. Her 
shoulders are hurting right now. <laughs> She's that is unreal. I'm okay with that. <laughs> you gotta get me on the back. Yeah, I know. We're gonna take turns. <laughs> Jeez, we better focus up, coach. Nice it's pot. That was awesome. And it's not us. All right, hole number one out of here, 437 yards. We obviously started on the back nine, so this is 10 for us. They're playing some music over there on the light left, so it's pretty loud. We've got some bunkers up there, pretty much straight ahead hole. Just gonna get aggressive here, see if we can birdie it. Marco ended up on this hillside, didn't make it in the bunker. He's just kind of in between the rough and the bunker, he's in a little peninsula. So pretty side hill, sitting down a little bit. Not a great place to try to make a birdie from. <laughs> Elise has been making everything in some great shots. So coach is in the middle of the fairway, thankfully, but I got to focus up here, try to hit a good shot and uh, see if we can make some birds. Uh, Marco started at left of the pin and going left. Oh, but pin high. On the green, looks like. Good shot. Coach, it's another fairway. Yeah, piped one down the <laughs> middle, got it all uh, figured out with the driver. Uh, just put a couple bad swings on it recently, but uh, no worries. Loving that shaft, loving that head. And uh, I got 83 yards left. I'm just going to hit a smooth little uh, 60 degree wedge. Started just right of the flag stake. It's drawn back. I stayed a little right, but I think he's on the green, probably 10 footer. Really nice shot. And if you guys want to pick up one of these hats that he's wearing, golfholics.com, there's also going to be a link up there. Made contact, went to the right a little. I think it'll be okay. Got 105 to the hole. Pretty much no wind. I think I'm going to play the yardage. Oh, wait, a little bit of wind. Yeah, I'm going to play the yardage. That looks really good. Oh, it hit that that thing and yeah. then came back. All right, guys, ladies uh, came up a little bit short and they're probably about 10 yards short of the green. And then coach ended up right at the front edge, right up against the lip pretty much. Um, and he's got probably 15, 20 footer. And then I was pin high, just a little bit left. Got about a 25, 30 footer. And then also on the back nine, they just punched the greens, uh, I think yesterday. So they'll be a little bumpy, but they still look like they're in good shape. So we should still make a few. All right, nice shot there. She's got about a four footer left for her par. Oh, she went for the make on that one. All right, just ended up a little long. Oh! That's <laughs> 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 beat. That's par, dude. All right, so this hole is like 400 and, it's like 450 yards from the tips. This hole goes hard left. That bunker on the left right there is about 270 yards from back here. So we gotta carry that, and then it's gonna kick down into the fairway. So hole is going very hard and to the left. Yeah. Got this pretty big side hill lie. Just gonna try and hit it through that gap, straight, straight in front of us, just left of the carts. Oh, he did a great job right there. Yep, and he couldn't have done any better. Great job. I've got 152 out of this bunker here. I'm clubbing up about 20 yards. Um, it's pretty uphill and into the wind. <clears throat> a lot of wind. All right, I got 151. Uh, I'll be standing in the bunker, it looks like. Probably just gonna hit like a little chippy six iron right here. You guys are probably wondering why he's hitting six. Cause he's gonna be choking down on this club and we're going into the wind. So coach is making the adjustment here. 
to make sure he has enough club to actually get there. And this thing is gonna probably come out pretty hard to the left, so you're gonna see him try to compensate for that and aim more to the right. Started at the right side of this green. This was a really good shot. And I think he's on the green. Nice shot, dude. It flared out to the right a bit. Oh, wow, right bunker. Marco laid up. He's probably got about 65 yards, maybe 70, all into the wind. He pulled it, it's coming right at me. But distance control, an A plus, and he's got about 10 feet per par. Well done. Elisa went bunker to bunker. She's going for the Bin Laden right here. She's got to carry it. Okay. Yeah, that was pretty good. She's probably got about 16, 17 feet left. She's got a pretty deep bunker. She's about 10 feet below us. She's got to carry it about 25 yards to that pin. Now she clipped it really well. Oh, it just went a little long. I don't know if it ran down or if it stayed up. Dang it. Nice pot. Okay, this is this is what you pay for out here. Ocean views and nothing but fairway taking you right out there. This looks beautiful. This hole is 315 yards and it looks like it's going pretty hard to the left, so I'm walking to the right of the tee box to see what else we can see, but it looks like not much. The fairway's out there, obviously the smart play is to lay it up and then just have a nice easy shot in from there. But I think Coach and I are gonna literally take a driver, rip it over this tree and try to get to the screen. Someone's out there living the good life, doing a little fishing, hanging out. Gosh, that looks awesome. Hit that uh, driving iron from Callaway, which I absolutely love, down the middle. I got about a 105, and I'm just gonna swoop it on in. Could not see the flag stick from back there, but coach started at the middle of the green and it was drawn over, so we'll see. I was gonna hit a driver there. I was gonna hit the big dog, and Mike tucked me out of it. He was like, just play smart, lay up, let's win this thing. So that's what I did. Perfect position. Got 90 yards. I'm gonna just hit a my 100 yard club, which is a 56, and just make sure I get up there because I see a ridge, false front that looks like it just everything feeds away. A couple of balls are short, so I don't want to be there with them. I hit this one crispy. It's right at the pin with a little fade. Oh, it went a little long. Okay. All right. So I got through the trees. I got really lucky. So I have about. 60 yards to the flag, and a little ocean breeze, so let's see if we can get it close. Oh, oh pretty good. God. All right, Elisa hit one just off to the left, and she's got about 60 yards. Oh, came up just a little shy. It's not gonna get up the hill. All right. All right, look at this view right here. We are playing in heaven right now. Looks like the big cat went a little long. He's in that kind of grassy uh, bunker. And then I ended up just on the front part of the green. I got about a 30 footer up a pretty big ridge. Okay, oh, it's gotta settle. Oh no, he didn't. I think it's going to be right next to mine. That's great. I'm going to get a read. We made a really good comeback. We were 
made three birdies back to back and we were at one under and then these guys made some crazy long putts for birdie again. So now we're three back again. <laughs> But we still have six holes, so stay tuned. Anything can happen. <laughs> yes, that's very true. So we have a giveaway with this video. If you and three friends want to come play Monarch Beach, they're giving out a foursome. So check the link below for that. Make sure you subscribe to this channel if you like it. Check out me and Isabel on Instagram and YouTube. And stay tuned. 